trying to hide the rod. What are you? There's a big fish swimming right there, but I can't tell what it is. Oh, that is a peacock. This is what I've been chasing for all day today. All right, so it's raining right now. I'm trying to see if I can get into some peacock bass. I'm trying to see what I could get into. I had a tarpon roll right here. Of all things, I was not expecting a tarpon right here. I mean, I've seen them occasionally. I got a peacock fly on. Tarpon roll coming straight at me. So there's a pipe buried underneath all of this hydrilla and grass. And I'm guessing it's flowing with all the rain we've had. And that's why the tarpon rolled around the front. Here goes another fish out here. Oh. Hoping to get some fish before the rain starts. Again, I've been dodging rain all afternoon, but it's finally actually catching up to me now, it appears. I'm using this uh, fly that was given to me by Neil. Let me dip around to the high percentage areas. Where I know the fish like to hang out because I clearly don't have much time. Left my rain jacket inside the car, of course. Just saw another tarpon roll. You know, through all my years of fishing here, I've seen very few tarpon. However, I've seen at least about five or six roll right now, and it's likely due to the weather. The weather has them excited. see let's see if we got anything willing to eat in this pipe I see a few mines down there already I'm not trying to catch those I want peacocks okay I see a peacock a couple peacocks came out to look at the fly a couple mines did too a Midas just pulled up so I gotta try to get the peacock without catching a mine or Midas got one got a nice one Not a big one, but he's not tiny either. He inhaled the fly though. Look at this. Got a peacock right here. I'm gonna let him go. See if I can get a bigger one. There are a few bigger ones swimming around down there. That's a good sign because the other ones at the previous lake were not aggressive at all. And the ones here are. So far the fish in this pond seem far more aggressive as you can see. Just got another peacock. Again, it's not that big, but there are some big ones down there. Bigger than the ones from the other spot. Bigger than the ones from the other day. Again, another little guy. There's some bigger ones down there. Just gotta weed through these small fish so a bigger one decides to get it, decides to beat out a little guy for it. Okay, what are you? Are you a mine? Are you a peacock? Hard to tell when they're that deep in dark water. I 
Okay, I see a peacock coming. There's a Midas behind it too. Pick it up and re redrop it behind this big peacock or bigger peacock. Oh, I just got freaking nailed. There's another small peacock. Got a Midas charging at it. Oh, peacock tried to eat it too, but I was taking it away from the Midas. See if I could drop it in the darkness of the pipe. So it appears there's, there's a bunch of fish sitting right out here on the edge of the grass, just outside the pipe. <laughs> there's some hungry peacocks trying to hide the rod. I'm laying it straight with the handlebar. So I laid the I laid the rod straight with the handlebar to see if they don't notice that I'm holding a rod and don't mess with me to try to just try to get in here and see if I can whack a big fish. This is a big fish spot. What are you? There's a big fish swimming right there, but I can't tell what it is. It looks a bit Oh, that is a peacock. It's just a very pinkish peacock, which is not something I see often. But there is a big peacock there. It almost reminds me of a Mayan cichlid, the way his cutters look in the water. But he just looked way too big and long to be a Mayan. Which is why I didn't automatically ride it off. It was a peacock. But I spooked them. But again, that's what we're looking for now. That was... Oh, I'm standing in an ant pile. Standing in a fire ant pile. Oh. These damn ants got me. Security's probably laughing at me right now. I'm in an area I'm not supposed to be standing on a massive ant pile because I was distracted by a big old peacock. Oh, they're still getting me. See, that's the ant pile. It did me in. All right, so I gotta keep an eye out for that as well. Let's see what the sign says, no swimming allowed. Okay. I did go past the sign that said no fishing, but this one doesn't say that. It just says no swimming. There is gators in here. I honestly don't even know why someone would want to swim in here. Little guy, don't want him. Ah, oh, come on. Gonna be wrapped up. Finally, a big fish. Come on.
There you have it. Pretty good sized peacock. This one's over three pounds. Really good fish. Let's get him back in the water. There he goes. Just like that, guys. Was able to walk the bank. Finally spotted one before I spooked them. Able to drop a fly on them. Finally, I was able to spot one before spooking them. And I managed to drop a fly on him. And he ate it. He saw it and he immediately slammed it. another good one guys there's a bunch of big ones down there there's actually the smallest one out of the group I'm gonna see if I could grab a big one There it is guys, that's the big one. This is a four pound fish, fighting super hard. Look how lit up and colorful he is. This guy, this is what I've been chasing for all day today. Check him out. Let's get him back in the water. All right, y'all, finally got into some big fish. Caught a couple of them. One was about three pounds. The other one was over four pounds, probably close to five. Right when I thought I was done and heading home, oh my God, I see a couple more giants. Let me see if I get one of these. Oh, I see so many, there's so many fish here.
Y'all watching? Yeah. Nah, peacock bass. No, definitely not. <laughs> Screenshot it. <laughs> Hold on, let me walk this over to my GoPro. Hold on. Just caught another one. Wandered off from where the GoPro was pointing, but managed to catch this nice one, another three pounder, maybe a little bit more. Let's get him back in the water. All right, y'all. That's it for this one. Had a blast. Caught a bunch of fish. Got into some big peacocks there at the end. So. For those of you that stuck around, you got to see some pretty good fish. So thanks for watching. Let's keep it going. Just drop it, break it. Drop it, break it.